Hey, what's up guys? Michael Doss, CEO here again. So today I am going to talk to you guys about growing your social media accounts again. So today we are gonna go over how to go from 1,000 followers to 10,000 followers. All right guys, we already talked about how to go from zero to your first thousand followers in episode two, I believe. So this is episode three and we are gonna be going over how to go from 1,000 to 10,000. Once you get to 10,000 guys, that's when you start making the big bucks and that's what we're shooting for. So let's do it. First 10,000 followers you guys are by far the hardest to get. It is easier to go from 10,000 followers all the way up to like 500,000 followers than it is to get from 100 followers all the way up to 10,000 followers. Okay you guys, trust me this is the hardest part and I'm sure you guys are still going to be able to do it. So let's get right into it then. Okay. So you guys already have, I'm gonna assume, one to 2,000 followers if you guys followed along with what I did in my last video, how to gain your first couple hundred followers and how to gain your first thousand followers. So you guys are already at 1,000 followers. You guys are gonna wanna start consist po consistently posting, okay? This is when it starts to get a little bit more important. And by consistently posting, I don't mean consistently posting the same stuff or consistently uh, just trying to like force yourself to post. Just if you think you have a good post and you're not too sure, just put it on there anyways. Who cares? It doesn't have to do amazing. Not all of your posts have to get extra likes. Yeah, it's, it, it's not really all just about the likes, you guys. Honestly, just getting that content out there is gonna be probably the most important part right now. So just keep posting, keep getting stuff out there, and you'll start to organically grow. Remember to be following along with what I talked about in episode two as well, talking about commenting on other people's pages, liking other people's pictures and making sure to consistently be following new users. This will draw people into your page, stuff like that. Okay, so let's pretend, let's just hypothetically here, you guys are at 2,000 followers or 1,500 followers, anywhere from the 1,000 follower mark to the 2,000 follower mark, okay? What you guys are gonna wanna do is you guys are gonna wanna find other pages that are, they're in the same niche as you, okay? So I'm gonna use uh, my dog again. I'm gonna use him as an example. Let's say I made my dog his own Instagram account. I'm gonna to wanna to find other pages that are the same size as mine that are dog related. So start searching through dogs pages, start th searching through dog hashtags, start th searching through pet pages, anything related to your niche and find an account that has anywhere from 1,000 to 5,000 followers. What you're gonna do is you're gonna contact these guys and you're gonna say, hey, do you wanna do a shout for shout? A shout for shout is where you post a picture of their content on your page and they post a picture of their content on of your content onto their page. So the idea here is you're exposing your content to their one to 2,000 followers, and they're also getting their content exposed to your followers. So you guys are gonna basically be trading followers at this point. So he's gonna post a picture of your product or whatever it may be of your post, and his 2,000 followers are gonna see it. Maybe 20, 30, 40 of them end up following you, okay? Same thing's gonna happen to him. It's a mutual, mutual beneficial relationship, and that's the best part about doing these show for shows. I'm sure you guys see them happening actually all the time. You guys just don't realize that that's what's going on. So now that you guys know that, I'm hoping you guys really take advantage of the show for show. The show for show is honestly by far the most important feature of growing your social media account. So make sure that you guys are networking, make sure that you guys are making connections, make sure that you guys are talking to other people in your niche market so you guys can do these kinds of things with them. Um, a little bit of a trick here is try and do shout for shouts with pages that have more followers than you. It does help and pages are willing to do it. As long as you have two to 3,000 followers, you can get a shout for shout with a page that has like five or 6,000 followers and you'll get a lot more out of it. You can even do a shout for shout with a page that has 10,000 followers. You make a trade, you say, I'll post three pictures of yours on my page and you post one picture of mine on your page. Since they have three times the followers, you have to put in three times the work to make up for it. That's that's kind of just how this market goes, so that's the way to do it. Um, buying promotions, okay? So buying promotions is a huge thing. You can contact other uh, large pages, uh, pages that have, let's say, a million followers or a couple hundred thousand followers, whatever it may be, and you can DM them, you can email them, or you can actually contact them through my app. My app is gonna be able to contact, connect influencers with other people looking to talk to influencers. So you guys can use my app as well, which is not out yet. I'm just putting it out there so you guys are aware of what is going on. But you're gonna wanna get in hold, get in contact with some of these other influencers and ask them what their promotion rates are. So shoot them a message saying promo rates question mark. 
keep it short and simple so that it doesn't get lost in their DMs. Send this to, I'd say, probably like 20 or 30 different pages that are in your niche market and compare their prices. See who has the best price compared to how much engagement that their page has. And by engagement, I mean their average amount of likes and average amount of comments, okay? And average amount of views if they're posting videos. By the way, videos are the best. If you can post videos instead of pictures on your page, they get 10 times the engagement. Uh, you know how they say a picture says a thousand words? A video says a fucking million, man. Like a video is the way to go, you guys. Trust me on that one, okay? So start buying some promos, guys. They, I'm not saying you have to. I've given you guys ways to grow for free if that's the option that you guys wanna do. But if you guys wanna invest 10, 20, 30 dollars, that's all it really takes. You guys can get a couple hundred followers. and. Once you get to like five or 10,000 followers, you can start doing shout for shouts with a lot more pages and it'll be a lot more effective. Cause if you shout out a page that has 10,000 followers and they shout you out, you guys are gonna start gaining like two, 300 followers each time you do the shout out. And that's how you start to really kind of like scale up the growth because right now you guys are in the early stages and your growth is gonna be extremely, extremely low. It's just about breaking certain barriers. We broke the 1,000 follower barrier. Now we're trying to hit that 10,000 follower barrier. Once we break this barrier, your account's just gonna start to skyrocket off. It's it's amazing to watch you guys, trust me. Um, and another thing is, once you get to like five or 6,000 uh, followers, you can actually start selling promotions. Then You don't get paid too much for them, a couple dollars here and there, but it's still enough to like, you sell your promos, make a couple dollars, save it up. Once you get like 20, 30 dollars saved up, buy another promotion. Once you buy this next promotion, you guys, you're gonna gain more followers, which means you can sell your promotions for more. So. Let me, let me do the quick math for you, okay? You buy a promotion for $10 and you go up 1,000 followers, hypothetically, okay? You sell a promotion for $1, so you have to sell 10 promotions just to be able to afford to buy yourself one promotion, okay? Now you buy this promotion and you go up 1,000 followers. Now we're at 2,000 followers, okay? You keep going, save up another $10, boom, buy another promotion, you're at 3,000 followers. Save up another $10, keep selling promotions, boom, now you're at 4,000, 5,000, 6,000. And in between this, you can be doing your shout for shouts, you can be liking other people's pictures, you can be commenting on other people's pictures, and you can be following other users, guys. Make sure you're combining all these different methods that I'm teaching you along all my different episodes all into like one full package. It's a lot of information, and that's why I have to do it in separate videos, but I'm telling you guys, I have done this time and time again. I've had over 10 million followers on Twitter, I've had over 4 million followers on uh, Instagram, uh, I just created my YouTube channel. I haven't even posted a video yet, so I'm creating all these videos before I actually start my channel up. Um, and I just created a TikTok account kind of for fun. Uh, I created it two days ago. I'm already at 200 followers. Feel free to go check me out on there too. It's michael.ceo. Um, yeah, guys, I'm telling you, I've used these methods time and time and time again, and I'm continuously growing my social media network. And the best part is, is once you grow your social media network, is there's so many different business opportunities that come up. If you find a product that you love, you can open up an online store and start promoting your product to your followers. You guys, you can make a full-time living and business out of this. Like I'm telling you guys, get into this. Social media is gonna be the next big form of advertisement. Right now, not a lot of people are able to figure out how to monetize their social media and that's why it's not really that big yet and there's only select individuals doing it. I'm trying to teach everybody so that everybody can be a social media star that they wanna be. So guys, let's get it. Follow the steps and I promise you guys, you're gonna be famous.